As the nation struggles to balance budgets and pay debts, Utah has managed to rise above the economic turbulence. Its unemployment rate sits below the national average, with total personal income and annual pay both on the rise. But economic prosperity isn't inherited. It's earned. It's planned. And that's where the Utah Science, Technology, and Research Initiative comes in. USTAR has laid the groundwork to ensure economic growth in Utah now and for the future. The initiative operates under a simple concept that education and innovation are the key drivers of economic success. The state-funded project started in 2006 as a way to leverage Utah's research universities to create and commercialize technology, which in turn generates new tech-based startups, new industries, new higher paying jobs, and more tax revenue. USTAR aims to diversify Utah's economy with high-quality jobs, recruit world-class researchers, build state-of-the-art research facilities, and deploy technology outreach teams statewide to spur collaboration between higher education and business. After studying the five-year cumulative economic effects of USTAR, the University of Utah's Bureau of Economic and Business Research determined that the initiative has resulted in 112 million in earnings for Utah workers contributed $219.3 million to the gross state product and raised $9.9 .9 million in additional state tax revenue. With the USTAR program in place, job creation in Utah is growing. There are 259 jobs that have grown out of tech outreach projects. 51 principal researchers are acting as new catalysts of innovation. 450 construction jobs in the 2012 fiscal year and 2,620 additional jobs stemming from the research and development earned funding. That's an estimated total of 3,380 jobs created by USTAR. To date, USTAR has met or exceeded its initial prospectus by recruiting 51 entrepreneurial-minded researchers from MIT, Harvard, UCLA, and other top universities. These researchers have produced 330 invention disclosures and 202 patents, secured 131 million in grants, and have started or relocated 10 companies with more commercialization projects currently under development. The third focus area for the USTAR initiative is the Technology Outreach Innovation Program. In 2012, technology outreach staff conducted more than 212 projects that supported companies, entrepreneurs, and researchers in 20 out of 29 counties in the state. The outreach team also facilitated the Technology Commercialization Grant Program. In the past three years alone, the grant program has resulted in 89 projects that have in turn attracted 20.3 million of private financing. Other results include 98 new product prototypes, 176 new jobs, and the launch of 30 new companies. The nation has taken notice of these staggering results. In a recent article, the Brookings Institution stated, USTAR has rapidly emerged as not just the state's primary innovation driver, but as a national best practice. It's a model for developing a regional network of technology outreach and innovation centers. And that's how USTAR is helping to ensure economic prosperity in Utah while showing the rest of the nation how it's done. To keep the momentum going, USTAR needs your support and is seeking $8 million in additional state funding. This will help USTAR achieve even greater success and generate additional state revenue. It will provide much needed support for higher education that will flow to nearly every college and university in Utah. It will boost local companies and entrepreneurs. So please support innovation-based economic development. Please support USTAR. Economic prosperity isn't inherited. It's earned. It's planned. And USTAR is making it happen.